If you can rise above your programming, you will see differently, hear differently, and comprehend it all in a new light. That what you see is not as solidly fixed and unchangeable. Where you are right now is more of mental prison than physical hindrance. The problem is never out there. But we have been taught to always look out there. Blame the world. And outsource our life to some external power or God. Not knowing that God or consciousness is experiencing this whole thing through us. It is not imposing its will on us. Rather, it is taking our direction and then materializing this life in the light of what we are mentally. So, if you are a person with a mindset that you are not good enough, it will materialize circumstances, events, and people to make sure that your inner conviction and belief is outpictured and validated. You see, consciousness is a big responsibility. It is your job to direct it. But it can't be done if you see an outside force to be controlling your life. Then you are impotent. But if you give your inner reality all the power. That my beliefs, thoughts, and feelings are the real reality. And my world is being sculpted every moment via my thoughts, feelings, and beliefs. Then you are overpowered. You can then do, be and have anything. Because the power is back inside you. Inner power is all that changes the world. If you derive your life from this perspective then you can change anything. This solidly real world will start to crumble right before your eyes. Only because you have changed your inner world. You were able to see past the programming. And the moment you see past it. It all seems a bit absurd. That is, what you used to believe in. That you are not good enough. You are not worthy of a rich and comfortable life. That you are unlovable. It will all seem like a bad joke. Because you make these rules about yourself. Because you are not yet fully conscious. Programming is nothing but automatic responses. It is akin to being unconscious in a way. Because you are living life of autopilot. So, you believe what you see. You get lost in the propaganda. You see one side of the story and you judge. But once you see past it, it is a whole another world. You no longer feel the urge to blame anyone. Nor do you judge. All you do is change your inner world and the thing you look at changes. You become more concerned about your inner world than anything from this illusionary world. And so, you start to control your life. Deliberately creating what you want. Purposefully experiencing what you want to experience. This is when you will realize that I am far greater than I thought. Even the sky is not a limit for me. I can have what I want. And experience what I want. And I don't even need anyone's help to do it. Yup. Your consciousness will take care of it all. It will all be done for you in ways you can't predict. The mastermind of this entire existence has all the ways and means you know not of. So, decide what you want. And give it to yourself by not doubting it. Not second guessing it. And just accept it and then see how it comes about in miraculous ways. Or maybe in the most ordinary ways. As we don't know the ways of the divine. You have tried to fight the world to get what you want. Now try the other way. Decide and give it to yourself mentally. Feel the satisfaction in the now. And then let it come to you. Stop chasing things. Allow them to come to you instead. This is the only way to know who you really are. When you exercise your power to have what you want, Otherwise, you will get back into the illusion. 